Speaking Section Directions In this section of the test, you will be able to demonstrate your ability to speak in English about a variety of topics by answering four questions. In the test, question one is about a familiar topic. Your response is scored on your ability to speak clearly and coherently about the topic. In questions two and three, your responses are based on what you have read and heard. First, you read a short text. The text goes away, and then you listen to a talk on the same topic. You are then asked a question about what you have read and heard. You need to combine appropriate information from the text, and then the talk to provide a complete answer to the question. For question four, you listen to part of a lecture. You are then asked a question about what you have heard. Your responses to questions two through four are scored on your ability to speak clearly and coherently and on your ability to accurately convey information about what you have read and or heard. Question one. Because of technology, students are able to learn better and more quickly. Do you agree with this statement? State your opinion and explain why you agree or disagree. Use specific reasons and examples to support your answer. And you have 15 seconds to prepare, and your time starts now. Now you have 45 seconds to speak. You may begin speaking now. I think technology is a powerful tool for learning, as by using it, students can access all sorts of information. For example, while I was doing my class assignments, I was having difficulty understanding the topic. I went on the internet and found the information I needed. This helped clarify the topic for me. Furthermore, I also found additional information that I made use of in my assignments. As a result, I was able to secure a good grade. I would never have learned this information without the internet, or it would have taken me a long time searching in a library. Another thing is that I do my assignments on my laptop and save them on it. This prevents the risk of misplacing them. Question 2. Directions. You will now read a short passage and then listen to a conversation on the same topic. You will then be asked a question about the passage. After you hear the question, you will have 30 seconds to prepare your response and 60 seconds to speak. You have 45 seconds to read the passage below. You may begin reading now. Now, listen to two students discussing this announcement. Hey, did you hear about the changes at the library? No, what changes? Well, starting next month, the library will have extended hours. We can now study and access resources even late at night. It's going to be so convenient for those late night cram sessions. That's awesome. I can finally have a peaceful place to focus on my research without any distractions. Absolutely. 
And that's not all. They are also introducing a self-checkout system for borrowing materials. No more waiting in long lines at the circulation desk during peak hours. We can quickly borrow books and other resources on our own. That's fantastic. It will save so much time. I am glad they are making these changes to improve the library experience for us. Me too. It's great to see the university taking steps to support our academic success and make our lives as students easier. I am looking forward to taking advantage of the extended hours and the new self-checkout system. The man expresses his opinion of the changes in the library. State his opinion and explain his reasons for holding that opinion. Now you have 60 seconds to speak. Your time starts now. The man expresses a positive opinion about the changes announced in the library. He states that the extended hours and the self-checkout system will be convenient and beneficial for students. He agrees with the announcement that the extended hours will provide more flexibility in study schedules, especially for last-minute studying, allowing students to access resources and study spaces at their convenience. The announcement states that the self-checkout system will streamline the borrowing process. He agrees with this and states that they would no longer have to wait in long lines at the circulation desk during rush hours. Now they would be able to borrow books on their own. Hence, the students would be saving time. The man sees these changes as improvements to the library experience that will support their academic success and make their lives easier. Question 3. Directions. You will now read a short passage and then listen to a lecture on the same topic. You will then be asked a question about the passage. After you hear the question, you will have 30 seconds to prepare your response and 60 seconds to speak. You have 45 seconds to read the passage below. You may begin reading now. Now, listen to part of a lecture in a biology class. The broken wing display, to lure predators away from the nest, is quite common. Let's see what the killdeer birds, for example, do. Since killdeer birds don't always pick the safest places to lay their eggs, they've developed a clever way to protect their young. 
They use the art of distraction. When it spots a predator close by, the killdeer parent will steal away from the nest and fly close to where the predator is. Then to attract the attention of the predator, it begins calling loudly while limping along and beating one wing against the ground. It then fans its colorful tail, predator away. The predator, thinking it has got an easy meal, will try to catch the crippled parent and leaves the nest alone. This seemingly crippled bird flies away farther just before the predator gets very close. So, the bird takes the predator farther from the nest where it repeats its act of being injured. And another example of the broken wing display is seen in the spotted sandpiper. It builds its nests near the water's edge, where thick and tall grasses are found. When a predator approaches a nest of spotted sandpiper chicks, the parent bird crawls low to the ground and pretends to have a broken wing. It will start shrieking at different in intensities to not only draw the predator's attention, but also warn the others. Here again, the predator will pursue the injured bird, giving the chicks time to escape. Once the predator is a safe distance away, the spotted sandpiper will fly off, leaving the predator confused and unable to locate the chicks. Using the examples of the killdeer bird and the spotted sandpiper, explain the concept of broken wing display. Now you have 60 seconds to speak. Your time starts now. Broken wing display is a clever adaptation that allows birds to protect their young from predators. By using a ruse to lure predators away from their nests, these birds are able to ensure the survival of their offspring and eggs. The professor explains this strategy by giving the example of the killdeer bird and the spotted sandpiper bird. When a predator approaches the nest, the killdeer parent attracts the predator's attention by calling out loudly and pretends to have a broken wing. It then fans out its bright colored tail, and the predator thinking that it has an easy catch, will follow the injured bird away from the nest. The killdeer bird flies farther, when the predator com comes near, and repeats its act till the predator is far away from the nest. The spotted sandpiper is another example. It too pretends to have a broken wing, and attracts the attention of the predator, by calling loudly. Again the predator is deceived into following the bird, which flies away, once the predator is far away from the nest. Question 4. Directions. You will now listen to part of a lecture. You will then be asked a question about it. After you hear the question, you will have 20 seconds to prepare your response and 60 seconds to speak. Now, listen to part of a lecture in a marketing class. Influencer marketing has become a powerful marketing strategy. Companies are leveraging this phenomenon by partnering with influencers to promote their products. Two aspects which influence the decision of the companies are authenticity and creativity in content creation. Authenticity is very crucial as customers can easily spot inauthentic promotional activities. When influencers genuinely believe in and advocate for a product, their audience is more likely to trust their recommendation. Imagine a travel influencer 
who partners with a luxury hotel chain. The influencer shares experiences of their stay at the hotel through stunning photos and engaging storytelling. The influencer also responds to comments, provides tips and recommendations, and shares behind-the-scenes glimpses of their stay. This personal perspective makes their audience see them as a trusted source. This leads to increased brand trust, loyalty, and potential bookings for the hotel. Another aspect is the creative and diverse content creation. Influencers with their unique style, tone, and voice bring a fresh perspective to the brand. For example, a fashion brand collaborates with a group of influencers from different backgrounds and styles to showcase their clothing line. Each influencer could create their own unique content featuring the brand's clothes, such as a lookbook, a styling tutorial, or a photo shoot. By featuring a diverse group of influencers, the brand can appeal to a wider audience and showcase how their clothing can be styled in different ways. This engaging content, thus, creates a stronger connection with the brand. Using points and examples from the talk, explain the two influencer marketing strategies described by the professor. Now you have 60 seconds to speak. Your time starts now. Influencer marketing is a powerful strategy, with two key characteristics, authenticity and creative content creation, impacting a company's decision. Today's consumers can spot inauthentic endorsements, making authenticity crucial. When influencers genuinely believe in a product, their audience is more likely to trust their recommendations. For instance, a travel influencer, who has partnered with a luxury hotel, engages personally with their audience, through storytelling and providing tips and responding to comments. This will create trust and potential bookings for the hotel. Additionally, influencer marketing allows for diverse content creation. For example, a fashion brand partners with influencers from different backgrounds and styles to showcase their clothing line. The influencers could use their unique content, like lookbooks or styling tutorials, to create a stronger connection with the audience and showcase the versatility of the clothing. This enables brands to appeal to a wider audience and create engaging content.